The Chicago Police Department going high tech to curb crime. Yeah, the department is now building up its smart policing arsenal. CBS 2 Susanna Song joining us live outside the 7th District Police Station. And Susanna, you have a preview of some of the new technology. Good morning. That's right, Lionel and Aaron. Chicago police are incorporating smarter policing strategy to help fight crime here in Chicago. And they're using workers over at the prestigious University of Chicago Crime Lab to help. Now, the latest technology is called Shot Spotter Gunshot Detection. New surveillance cameras will be installed, and police will also be able to use license plate recognition software. It is real time information that will be accessible on smartphones and computers. They installed this in the South and west sides of Chicago already, specifically in the Harrison and Englewood districts, which accounted for over a third of the increase in homicides last year. Chicago police will also start using new strategic decision support centers, which takes real-time intelligence with data analysis from the U of C crime lab. On Saturday, Superintendent Eddie Johnson spoke at a town hall meeting about combating crime in certain areas of the city. We have 22 police districts Five of those districts account for most of our violence in this city. Three of them are really the ones that, that push it. Two on the west side and one on the south side. Superintendent Eddie Johnson will be joined by Mayor Rahm Emanuel and an LAPD deputy chief at 1045 this morning during a press conference to further explain this high technology that, again, is supposed to help curb crime here in Chicago. We are live in Englewood. Susanna Song, CBS 2 News. Susanna, thank you.